Well, guys, I get quite the greeting these days coming into the chicken coop. Get back in here, guys. Come on. These little guys are far from shy. And as you can see, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Now, don't know what exactly happened. As you can see, our little crippled buddy here is, um, is still alive and fine. So I don't think it's a predator because predators tend to target the weaklings. And uh, for a second I thought we were missing an, one of these guys, but I realized that one of the hens was just hiding underneath. But if you look here, I'll bring it into the light. One of these little ones, one of the hatchlings has died. And luckily, I mean, the only plus side to this, hey, get back in there, guys, get back in there. Your food and water's in there, what are you doing? No, get back in there, go on. Go on, good guy. So now we're down to only six. Luckily, the only upside we could see to this is that I do believe it was a rooster, if you look at the comb there. But I, I wanna, I wanna know what might have caused this. I don't see, I mean, he's really, I mean, He's trying to look maybe at the head for signs of foul play from the older chickens, but I really don't see anything that would cause concern as to that. Plus, they don't really bother the little ones at all anymore, so I don't know what it is that would have killed him, what it is that caused it, but here he is dead. I guess the only thing I could figure is maybe he choked or something, but uh, yeah, he's dead. So we're down one. Luckily, I'm pretty sure it's a rooster. Not exactly sure what it was, but uh, he hasn't been dead overly long. His body is cold, but he's not really stiff yet. So I think he's probably just been dead for it. I'm pretty. He was alive last night, I know. So I don't know what killed him. Pretty sure it was a rooster, but we'll see if anything continues because it might be a sickness, which would be bad. But anyway, that's it for now. And uh, we'll see you guys next time. Well, guys, we are out in the chicken coop. And as you know, one of the little chicks died. Happy to say all the rest of them are fine. And today, I just recently um, reset the traps I have out there. I had to spring them because I wasn't feeling well. And we left for the weekend. And I can't be checking them every 24 hours. Legally, you have to. And since I couldn't, I had to spring them. So I just reset them. I had a mouse that I caught in a trap that I used as bait on the one, and the little chicken that we lost in here, I used to bait the other. Call me a terrible person, but I mean, there's no point let it go to waste. So yeah, that's what's up, and uh, everybody else in here is doing okay, haven't lost any more chickens, and uh, I don't know what, she goes in that nest box every single day. She's like four, three or so months old, I think, three or months old. And she's, oh, I, don't even ask me, I don't know, she's, well, yeah, I don't know, she's not old enough to be laying eggs. And this one's still broody, I put a couple more eggs under her to see if she'll do the right job. If she doesn't, then, uh, well then she's fired for good and I'm gonna kick her out, but, anyway, that's what's going on, and, uh, yeah, so, see you later.